Hey y'all, it's Key, and today I want to talk to you about what it was like getting my hair professionally done for the first time in a little over three years. I used a website called Style Seat, and I had some Molly twists installed, and I just want to tell you what it was like from start to finish, tell you the pros and cons. So, here we go. So I'm getting myself ready for my first visit in about three years getting some kinky twists installed today seven packs of this cuban twist hair into a marley braid style i'm super excited about it um this is my stylist she busy she hard at work miss sabrina hi hi so she is about to shampoo me i'm sitting in a shampoo bowl for the first time in goodness knows how long so i'm excited so right now Sabrina's doing the moisturizing shampoo. She just did the clarifying shampoo. And she's using the Cocoa Curls line. So that's exciting because I've been wanting to try that. And this is the best shampoo. Oh, it's such a great massage. Oh, you said you had it been in the salon in almost four years. What's happening now is I'm doing a deep conditioning treatment. Um, Sabrina used the Cocoa Curls conditioner. Let me just go ahead and insert a clip here of what the Cocoa Curls product is. So she used the clarifying shampoo um, followed up by the um, conditioning shampoo. Or what did she call it? The cream shampoo? as well as a conditioner. And to make this a deep conditioner, because she knows I'm concerned about um, thin spots and um, you know just regrowth of, some of those thinner spots. And I'm also concerned about hair, this braiding hair pulling on my edges. So she put Jamaican black castor oil in the conditioner so that it would be part of the benefit. And when she smoothed the conditioner onto my hair, she then went in and massaged it onto my scalp, which was amazing. Singing, singing, singing is what I felt like doing when she did that. So I'm under the dryer for 15 minutes. Let me see what happens next. Okay, now she's detangling me. Now, one tip that Sabrina gave me while we were in the bowl was don't leave a leave-in conditioner in your hair. And I've been doing that for goodness knows how long. Not even no. regular conditioner. Oh, yeah. It's supposed to be rinsed out? Rinsed out. Mm -hmm. And why did you say it's, a, it's not good to leave it in? Because it can cause a lot of protein buildup in the hair and then over time it makes the hair very hard. Yeah. So ladies, that's a tip from a professional. We gotta rinse it out if we're supposed to rinse it out. <laughs> now, although I have thoroughly enjoyed this visit up until this point, this is where things kind of turn around. This is not the way I detangle my hair at all. I mean, right now my hair is product free. I'm not exactly sure why she rinsed the conditioner out before detangling my hair, but she did. And now I'm under the dryer and my hair is loose. And all I can think is there are tangles forming while I sit under this dryer. I am super concerned. And she dried the hair out to put the conditioner on it. You know, this just isn't my process. And I have to tell you, um, she and I had an hour-long consultation where we talked about the process in detail and I thought I had an understanding But I guess I just didn't you know, I don't know if I heard what I wanted to hear and I thought to myself, you know, while we were talking this lady is natural She knows how to take care of natural hair, but girls Nobody is going to take care of your hair the way you will so don't expect them to now some pros to this visit that I really appreciate are the ambiance. I have never been in a more beautiful salon where people were kind to one another. They were playing Christian music and everybody was just sweet as pie. I mean, I love the salon. And my stylist was fantastic. Her manner, you know, the way she spoke to me and she was very professional but also sweet. Um, I love the products that she used and the fact that they were all natural and they were black owned. So there were some things about this visit that I really, really liked, but this detangling process, oh man, my nerves were on edge. I couldn't really enjoy the salon experience because I kept thinking, oh, I hear my hair popping as you detangle it and my scalp is so tender from this pulling. You know, somebody braiding your scalp for eight to 10 hours, that's gonna make your scalp sore. So take you some ibuprofen before you have a process like this done. Now watch the way she twists my hair. 
I mean, she is just perfection in her twisting skills. Um, I couldn't have asked for better, but I will say if I do something like this again in the future, although I'm going to have to forego the whole glorious shampooing experience, I will shampoo my own head at home. I will detangle my own head. I will blow dry my own head and treat it like the baby that it is. Because nobody's going to baby my hair the way I baby it. And honey, my hair is special. Don't you feel like that? That is your girl, honey. That is your pride and joy. Well, you know, somebody else isn't going to feel like that. And then maybe they do. But maybe that's how they treat their own hair. So I am not going to give anybody else the opportunity to detangle my baby. Because I don't like the way it's done. However... I love the way she twists and I love the way these twists turn out. It was great to have a month off from styling my hair and for that I am eternally grateful. So this was my experience with Style Seat. Um, I love it because I, you can tell it exactly where you live and exactly what you want. You can um, see your stylist's previous pictures. You can read reviews on your stylist. You can set up a consultation. Uh, you can know her exact prices before you walk in the door so you're not shocked. So I give Style C two thumbs up. But um, out of eight, I'll give this experience probably about a five, maybe a 5.5. But was supposed to take seven hours, ended up taking ten. That's his own issue. But um, yeah, this was my experience. I hope it helped someone. I um, hope you're having a fantastic winter here in South Carolina. It is 80 degrees the day before Christmas. So that's crazy. But um, it's a blessing to be alive. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching. If you have used Style C, be sure to let me know in the comments. Let me know your experience. And what did you use it for? For natural hair? For lip wax? Whatever, child. Just, just shout it out in the comments. So, thanks so much for watching, and um, I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Mmm.